Okay, so we're gonna start this Monday chit chat over again because I just messed up the whole thing. But yeah, so we are doing the same old, same old. I'm outside. I wanna show you all my plants I got since I'm sitting over here without turning off my video. Those are sunflowers, I got those. I hope y'all can hear me. Um, and then this is a tulip. It's the Queen of Midnight tulip. They're really pretty. Um, and then these three are tomatoes. That is another tulip. I don't know what kind. And then these three are tomatoes. And they've grown like crazy. And then that's another midnight tulip. And like the sunflowers, we've done these from seeds and they've gone insane. So we're going to have to thin them out. But yeah. So I'm hoping we can get a few sunflowers out of those. But yeah. So that's what's going on with our plants. I'm going to, if the tomatoes keep going, I'm going to turn around and get some more things and plant them. But I didn't know how they would do because I have to do them in containers because I don't have anything else. So we tried to grow a pineapple, right? And the pineapple we were growing, I think was stolen by a possum. <laughs> Chloe was so upset. Oh my gosh, she was really, really, really upset. Don't even get me started. Oh, here pineapple. she comes. She heard me from the living room. I had to restart the video, so. Oh, and she broke her arm, see? See, see? And I will tell you that story in a second, but go on for the pineapple, Missy. I'm so angry. <laughs> we cut the top off it. We put it in, the, in a bucket with water so it could grow the roots before we could plant it. I come out the next day to water my sunflowers, my tomatoes and stuff, and the damn pineapple's gone. Someone <laughs> took the pineapple. She's very, very upset over this pineapple. Mom <laughs> just takes the top of a pineapple. I went out and looked and there was, it was like, I was like, there's the bucket with the water. I was like, where's the pineapple? <laughs> I think a possum took it. No. Yeah. That's unacceptable. <laughs> yeah, it's unacceptable. You may carry on with so, your No, day. no, 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 no. We're going to talk about your arms. Sit gonna, down. No. Sit down. Oh. I'll go through the back door. <laughs> back door's locked. Sit down. Hey, hey, guys. Unlock the back door. Do not unlock, unlock the, the back, back door. door. She doesn't want to talk about this. Thank you. Unlock Leave it, it locked. Please. Do not unlock it. Unlock it. Unlock. Whoever unlocks it's grounded. Unlock it. <laughs> okay, talk, let's talk about the pineapple. Don't break the store. Oh, I'm not talking about pineapple. I mean, we're going to talk about her. This is our my house. Oh. Okay, so let's talk about her broken arm since she is too much of a chicken to talk about your broke her broken arm. This girl comes in my room, and mind you, mm, because we've had a lot going on, I've had a ton of anxiety and ton of depression. Okay, um, yes, I'm medicated and I'm fine, but you know it kind of hits. It's like, oh, but whatever so that night I was having some depression and um, I knew I had to take an anxiety sleeping pill anxiety depression sleeping pill because otherwise then it would have turned into anxiety I wouldn't have slept you know so I had to do it I, and I try to only take them when needed so um, I take this thing right <laughs> I am I'm sleeping soundly for an hour maybe an hour and a half here she comes now mind you i've checked on all the kids they're teenagers so they kind of stay up a little bit and it's safe it's okay so you know she comes in mom mom i think i broke my arm it doesn't even register with me i'm like yeah let me look at it so i look at it you're fine go put some ice on it and i'll wake up and we'll you know do what we have to do mom of the year award goes to me because I went back to sleep. I just barely even remember that conversation, but I do remember it. So then, then she comes back in around 20 minutes later, mom, you need to wake up and really look at my arm. It's hurting. This ice is not helping. So I wake up slightly and I tell her, let's leave it till later. You're fine. Go back to bed. I didn't even open my eyes. But at this point, my brain's starting to say, wait, hey, you need to get up and look at something and do something. So I'm starting to like focus and function and whatnot. So she, I call her back in the room in about 10 minutes. I'm like, and at this point, she's really pissed at me. And, um, 
it's only funny because I'm like, okay, what did you do? I had to focus. She's like, I said, let me see it again. And I look and it's got a good bump on her arm. And I'm like, and it's swelling. I'm like, okay, give me a minute. I need to make some coffee because I have to take you. What did you do? So I got my foot caught in my blanket, she says, <laughs> as I was trying to get out of my bed. And I started to trip. So I then grabbed and then tripped over the fan, right? And then she hit the floor. So she didn't even do anything graceful or do anything worth it. She just was full on klutz. But she has a hairline fracture. So I was up all night that I had to call out of work the next day because one, I was up and awake driving on a sleeping pill. I mean, I was okay. So I was fine. I coffeed myself up before I went, but then I came home and I was just exhausted. Like I needed, I, we didn't get home to like five in the morning. So I crashed until noon and that was just it. And then I called work and I'm like, listen, this is what happened and blah, blah, blah. And they were fine. But, um, yeah, first they said it was not broken the first night we went. Right. And they said she bruised her bone. I looked at it and I'm like, that doesn't look like a bruised bone. Now, Chloe has broken both wrists before, not at the same time, but one when she was in first grade, one when she was in fifth grade. And then now she's in 10th, maybe it was sixth grade. I don't know, fifth, sixth grade, whatever. And um, so, and she bruised her bone in between that time. And she's like, mom, this feels like a break, not like a bruise. I'm like, okay, but they said bruised. Maybe it's where it is. We'll watch it for a couple days. So this was Thursday into Friday, like Thursday night into Friday morning that we went the first time I took her yesterday after I got off of work. Cause she was just like, mom, mom, it hurts. It hurts. It's just not getting better. And she's taking like 800 milligram Motrin for it. And it's not doing anything. So I take her back. And I, when I take her back, they do another x-ray and they tell me it's fractured. I'm like, hmm. So then they wrap her in that mess and I have to take her to an orthopedic this week. Well, pods were two dollars so we didn't get them. Are you serious? No, no, no. I talked to my dad. Oh, anyway, they are back. Mm -hmm. Hi, uh -huh. And then there's Kira. That is my booty. I'm like getting you in the fence. Say hi. I'm 12. You're 12. Almost. Her birthday Sunday, everybody. So she's, she's 12. Then I have no more birthdays for my family till July, so yay. Anyway, so yeah, we have a hairline fracture. 29th. 29th. Um, and then, um. Can I get back on the Yeah, hold on, Kira. And then, um, so we did that. Um, we went to the beach on Saturday. Oh, it was amazing. My ex-husband, the one that I had here, hated it so we never went to the beach while we live in Florida I've been twice this season already because we can go to the beach without being told no so that's awesome um but yeah I mean really it's nothing going on except life pretty much so um I am gonna go do a plan with ugh, maybe that's a lie I might not do it I might just write in there we have to go to court this week um for things that have happened so um that's also got me a little on edge and not okay, but, um, yeah, so we got to do that. Um, I've got to work a lot. It's same old stuff. Um, but I definitely need to get back into the Sunday things. So I'm going to do those. Um, budget's been a little off this month, but I have reasons and, and they're not great reasons, but it's just life is happening. So, I get called to go to an attorney's office. I get called to do this, which means I have to take off work and it started to really irritate the poop out of me. But we're okay, so. And then there's Kira just chewing on her fingers. <laughs> um, but yeah, so I'm gonna go ahead and end this here. Um, I hope y'all up north are enjoying the snow in the Midwest or enjoying the snow while we were at the beach. She wants you to like, subscribe, comment, go to social media, because I am posting there. So everything's in my bio. Everything's in my bio. Description yeah. Description bio. What are you saying? Nothing. Nothing. Okay. All right. Well, we'll talk to you soon. Y'all have a good one. All right. Bye.